promotion place into the Premiership. And from the off, they took the game to Stockport. David Johnson going close there. And indeed, the striker seemed to be involved in the centre of everything Ipswich were creating. Then Jim Magilton tried his luck from distance on the greasy Portman Road surface. Carlo Nash not enjoying life in the Stockport goal. So Magilton tried again. And that fine strike gave Ipswich a deserved 1-0 lead at the break. In the second half, Johnson was in the thick of the action again. Yet however many chances he had, he still couldn't make the game safe for his side. Finally taken off and Naylor came on. But he had no more luck in front of goal. Manager George Burley doing his best to calm his men down. But in the end, the one goal proved enough. Ipswich moving three points clear of Bradford and that much nearer to a return to the top flight. Guy Swindles, Sky News. Still alive, aren't they? Uh, there's the goal. Howard Forrington uh, is the fella's name. First goal for the club since his £70,000 signing from Yeovil uh, two years ago, so he's, he's been there a while. But uh, they loved that, didn't they? Road. Now, Norwich two up in the first five minutes. Uh, there's the first from Ewan Roberts. And, uh, well, no sooner has he uh, celebrated that one than he scored another one. And uh, at that stage, Norwich must have been uh, well set. But uh, once again, they perhaps took their foot off the gas a little. Bolton playing quite well at the moment. And uh, second half for them, a different story. Fox, first of all. Oh dear, might ask Bez about the keeper there. And uh, then just uh, 16 minutes from time, Franson uh, equalised for Bolton. There's the top then, Bolton fifth. Birmingham fourth, uh, Ipswich Town, uh, they did well tonight, didn't they, uh, winning? They're uh, up to 83. Sunderland, of course, uh, have flown to the Premiership already. You'll choose your other teams you want to have a look at there. Uh, Dave's with us.